So from an impressive and in many ways familiar shortlist, I'm delighted to announce the 2016 Venue of the Year is... Glad Cafe to get this award. I have brought a little piece of paper. I wasn't wanting to be presumptuous, but my son attended an award ceremony, absolutely convinced that we weren't going to win. So he had quite a lot to drink. And all he managed to do when he got to the stage was swear and start crying. So I don't want to do the same thing myself. So a few words. We are honoured, really honoured to get this award and a, a huge thank you to whoever it was who was kind enough to nominate us, those who shortlisted us and of course our audiences who must have voted for us. We've been operating now for five years and we run an eclectic range of music out there in our venue um, on a daily basis. Once a week we host in the cafe itself a trad session which is faithfully led by Matthew, uh, Martin and Sarah Hunter. So we thank them for their support. <laughs> In the venue, we've seen some amazing trad and roots musicians over the years. Uh, from Rachel Newton and the Furrow Collect Collective, Laurie Watson and Boreas, Kayla Rowan, Ian Morrison, Kaylee Trail, Gillian Frame, Rab Noakes, <laughs> And we're fortunate to be able to count as friends a number of great musicians and innovators who add so much to the tradition, such as Ali Robertson, Trembling Bells. This year, we were lucky enough to get some money from Creative Scotland, which allowed us to bring Pakistani musicians to the Glad Cafe for two weeks. And they worked with local um, Scottish musicians to create new music. So that was a wonderful way of bringing traditions together as well. We're excited by the dynamism within the traditional music scene in Scotland and also by its connections with roots musicians around the world. We aim to continue to provide a home and a platform for such music at the Glad Cafe. And I should end just by saying thank you to my poor long-suffering husband Craig, who is something of an inspiration to me, but also to Joe Smiley and Kim Blythe who run our venue and without them, I wouldn't be standing here just now. So thanks a lot. Thank you.